Uh, my name is Tim Nice. I'm the general manager for Jensen Precast of the Pacific Northwest, and this project was located in Jefferson County, uh, Washington, uh, near the Hood Canal on Shine Creek. The old culvert was a corrugated pipe running under the roadway, and it was basically uh, restricting um, the water flow and was not adequate um, for uh, salmon and steelhead to migrate um, upstream. So the uh, culvert that we provided to replace um, the existing culvert was 127 feet in length. Um, it was 16 three-sided structures, 18-foot uh, span. Um, it included 26 footings that were 8-foot-3 uh, by 10-foot-3. Uh, the bases weighed approximately 46,000 pounds. The footings were 20,000 pounds. The overall structure height was 19 foot 10, and this would be considered a type three uh, culvert configuration. Really why this is important is um, as far as salmon and steelhead, uh, they provided an important food source for over 100 species of wildlife, including orca whales. Uh, they contribute to Washington's economy through recreational and commercial fishing, and they support an estimated 16,000 jobs and over 500 million in personal income alone. And they have a cultural importance to many tribes who rely on salmon and steelhead as a food source. Uh, so starting in uh, 2021, uh, we have manufactured at Jensen uh, 26 fish passage culverts, uh, 10 uh, of which were uh, WSDOT culverts, and 13 uh, were made up of city and county and federal uh, jurisdictions. Um, with uh, an additional 10 being produced uh, here in 24. So it's a it's a good feeling, um, you know, here to be a part of these projects and to be good stewards of the environment and to be a contributor and a partner uh, with the state uh, and providing um, good infrastructure uh, for the citizens of Washington. Um, and we look forward um, to continue to be a partner and to um, improve um, the fish passage culverts uh, throughout, uh, you know, the next decade at least. Thank you.